For the last 10 years, I've had essential tremors. I've come to do to get it taken care of. Hold out your hands like that. Okay. Essential tremor is often called the shakes, and it's usually an intention tremor. So when you start to do things, whether it's drinking a cup of water, or eating, uh, or writing, all of those things can bring out the tremor as you start to do those activities. Eating. Everybody holds their head down when you say eating. The one thing we all have to do became less joy for me. Drinking out of a cup became a two-hand job. Or using a cup that's got a cover and a straw, which I refer to as a sippy cup. Get done. They kept manipulating my medication, didn't hope that would take care of it. And then my neurologist came up with uh, high intensity focus ultrasound. And that's what saved the day. It takes ultrasound waves, but uses a higher amount of energy and focuses that ultrasound on one specific spot to help treat, in this case, the tremor that's seen in patients with essential tremor. So we typically, as in Mr. Phillips' case, will treat the dominant hand and if they would like, nine months later, we'll treat the other side. It was really quite amazing. It was uh, something of the future. They would stop and they would roll me out of the MRI machine and they'd have me do this test and I could see it. It was, it was happening. We were all excited. I was giddy. I, I, I couldn't withhold my excitement. I smiled for days. Still do. Hey, baby. Hey. How you doing? Perfect. Let me see you right here. Praise the oh Lord. My God. <laughs> There's 10 million Americans with essential tremor. Very few of them seek surgical treatment options. If there's an incisionless way, to offer an outpatient surgery that provides immediate tremor reduction, that's much more appealing for many patients. In front of your eyes, patients are going from severe tremor to you know, significantly less, uh, mild to no tremor, and they can see it for themselves over the course of usually 90 minutes is how long a typical procedure takes, and when they go home, you know, they're able to have that benefit right away. It's very gratifying to be part of a a great team here at Duke that is able to help so many patients and help improve their quality of life in a fairly immediate way. Now as you can see the left hand is shaking quite a bit. The right hand is the one that I've already had treated. I've been extremely pleased with how it turned out. I hope to go back and get the left side done. From then on, I don't know what the future holds. Maybe on the next rocket ship to Mars, I don't know. <laughs>